Hey there guys, uh, welcome back. Today I'm going to go over how to set up Live Link Face for your um, MetaHuman character in Unreal Engine. So here's our guy that we've been working on. Um, and yeah. So to do Live Link Face, you're um, going to need an iPhone. I believe it's iPhone X and beyond, and the reason for that is that they have that um, depth um, face tracking AR technology that uh, I think they use for emojis or something. Um, but yeah, that's what you're going to need. And so this is what it looks like. Um, this is a screenshot from an iPhone that I took. Um, you just download that. Then um, you're gonna need to go into the settings of the. Um, once you go into the settings of uh, that app, you can um, go click on this live link button, and you can type in the name of your phone. You can name it whatever you like. And then once you're in it, you're going to yeah, you can name it here, and then you can um, you're gonna have to add target. Uh, this is your gonna be this is gonna be your IP address. Uh, you can get that through um, right clicking um, open network settings, going to properties, and scrolling down. It's gonna be the I, IP uh, v4 or something. Um, the other thing you're going to need to do, which uh, I always forget. Um, you need uh, Apple AR kit. So I just uh, yeah turn that on. I think we need this one too. So turn these both on. And then when you go into um, window, live link. Actually, I'm open over here. You're gonna see the phone show up, and that now you know it's working. So that's that's uh, the setup you're gonna need to make sure you have. Um, so we, when we click our character, we can go to the face and go to the Anim blueprint of that. Double click here. And then over here is already set up um, or showing up. You could just click on, um, you're going to be able to drop down and see your iPhone. So I have the app open up on my phone right now, so you can see it moving, testing, t testing, testing, yep, let's see, and to see in here, you're just going to press play. Okay, so in this portion, I'm just like fumbling around a little bit because I forgot where the button was, but um, there's something I wanted to mention, and this time is um, just make sure your phone and your computer that Unreal Engine is on. It's on the same network, um, so it can be wired and wireless, doesn't matter. Um, and if you still have issues connecting, maybe check your uh, firewall. So you have to sometimes set up uh, port forwarding or port open uh, exceptions. Um, so I think uh, Unreal's default port that's open is like 7777, so that's four sevens. And I think in the live link phase, the default is five ones, so one 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 one. Uh, yeah. So when you click on your character, click on BP here, <coughs> and select uh, live link face head. Then we can select the phone, and now we press play. Our character will track our. Um, Our mouth movements. We get into a better frame. All right, so that's how we um, set up the mouth movements or eyes too, and everything. Um, yeah, that's how I set things up. So to 
uh, record the animations for, say, use later on in um, something like a cinematic or level sequence, you're going to have to record the facial animation. So to do that, we're going to use the go to window, cinematics, take recorder. Uh, sequence recorder was the old one, I think. So now take recorder is the current one. So it just opens up a uh, empty sequencer for you. And so, just gotta go here, select him, track, add, or actually, no, you don't need to do that. Source from actor. And I believe you just, um, Press record. So um, press play. Okay, so I believe we are recording right now. So let's see how this. Okay, we actually. Okay, so now we are, will be recording now. So, yeah, right now we are recording all of the facial animations. So you can use this uh, later on uh, for whatever you need. All right, let's see how that came out. Press stop. Stop here. takes all right so content cinematics takes right here so it's recording everything um, right now we just want the facial animation Let's see. so now we have like um, Nice animation sequence. Okay. Let's go to this little sequence. Okay, so as you can see, once we move remove the control rig, we can uh, stick on this uh, animation sequence. Uh, yeah, actually, you could just uh, press the plus button right here. So let's just make sure it's the right one. So just delete that, and so say you had a face, animation, there you go. Yeah, uh, not too hard. Hope you enjoyed it. Thanks for watching.